All the snow and ice has caused another dock to collapse out on Old Hickory Lake, and now marinas across Middle Tennessee are concerned they could be next. News Channel 5's Chris Davis spoke to a boat owner who watched the dock he had been using for a decade crumble right in front of him. It happened in an instant. All of a sudden, it collapsed right there in front of me. And I'll start yelling. My wife came around. I was like, oh my God, our dock just collapsed. So, a shock to be sure, but it was something Brian Hill had been worried about for days, with all the ice and snow weighing down on the roof. In fact, that's why he was flying his drone to get a closer look. The fingers, the walkways were underwater a little bit. Wednesday, he and a few others decided it was no longer safe and moved their boats to other, more stable docks. Uh, it had gotten uh, much lower yesterday. Uh, we all put waders on and got out in the water on the dock, uh, it's almost waist high uh, at that point. IDOC is the second to collapse at Blue Turtle Bay in just 24 hours, the fourth on Old Hickory Lake since Monday. It's nature and docks are, you know, at least the docks here, it's not like up north. They're not uh, built to withstand that type of weight from snow and ice. Boat owners at Percy Priest Lake are now worried they could be next. No, I just kind of wanted to check out, make sure everything's good. Ryan Powers and his friend Jason rushed over to Nashville Shores Marina. They learned their sailboat was fine, but other vessels in a covered dock could be in danger. These photos show the dock sinking and the gangways covered with water. And even if boat owners wanted to come here and do something about it, just getting down down here could be dangerous in and of itself. Hope for the best and where insurance comes into play. Back over at Blue Turtle Bay, because of the dangerous situation, the entire property is on lockdown. Brian is worried more docks could meet a similar fate. Hopefully those hold out, but there are definitely uh, some others that are in danger over there. Chris Davis, News Channel 5. Thanks, Chris. And to make matters worse, many boat owners who may be tempted to take their vessel out of the water are not able to because of icy boat ramps.